guys and welcome back to the Locked In channel. I'm about to look into the lens. I keep looking over there. We are a Locked In family. Doom, 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 doom. We built together forever. Doom, 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 doom. We are a Locked In family. We are a family. Yeah. Okay. So. This week we're talking about while well, Lion is kind of sleeping, waking up. No. Yeah, my just. <laughs> we're talking about sexual harassment at work. <gasps> doom doom doom. <laughs> so Yeah, I've been sexually harassed at work. This big six fat. You don't even say that <laughs> because there's probably men yeah, who are yeah, yeah. six foot seven or six foot twelve wherever you are they probably just wouldn't call it sexual harassment yeah they have another name which is sad <laughs> even we went to an event with carl i went to an event with carl yeah it was a real get out moment and they were like um, <laughs> no it was a real get out moment how handsome is he I'm, are you handsome? <laughs> oh not bad hey nielsen <sighs> So, is it true? Is it better? Wow, wow. Wow. And then the woman was like to me, oh, I just love Carl, I love him. She was with her husband. Yeah. She was like, he's just so black and chocolate. Mm -hmm. I know he's got a big black <laughs> dick. <laughs> My days. <laughs> <laughs> you see how long I'm looking yeah. at you guys for? Because that is absolutely disrespectful. Wow. Number one. Number two, you don't say that. It's number three, I'm a Christian woman. Wow. Oh. Don't say that to me, please. Wow. Get D. <laughs> Behind <laughs> me, Satan. <laughs> no, I'm but yeah, let me get into it because it looks like the battery's dying. I don't oh, know wow. how. And now oh, wow. Lion, yeah, yeah, yeah. Lion is. Go, yo, that's flashing red. Mate. Eyes are opening. <laughs> I can't, like, this is like. How are you going to do the Because then he goes down, he goes down, and then... So anyway, basically, what had happened was, um, I was at work, and I used to work in McDonald's, where I was getting four pounds an hour. Wow. I want to see my nails, that's why I keep doing this. <laughs> yeah, I was getting four pounds an hour, and um, lion's awake, but let's carry on. Yeah. And then basically, what had happened was, I was like, um, I was at work, and then my manager would always kind of like talk to me, he was cool, he was quite young, yeah. quite, he looked a bit like you. Was you him? <laughs> Don't do that. Are you him? Don't ask me on my hand. And then anyway, like so he was like, all right, Cass, um, like after a couple of weeks, you Not know, it's just hour. been, you know, him talking to me, <laughs> gaining my trust and me really just like loving where I worked, like yeah. even though it was four pounds an hour, just enjoying it. And he was quite older than me. So I was 16 and I think he would have been about 32. Oh, okay. Yeah. So quite, yeah. quite older yeah, than yeah. me. Yeah, yeah. Over and, day, um, yeah. Just like he was a nice, he was a nice manager. So he was like, "Oh, do you want to um, come out with the team? You know, after do you want to come out with the team? Wow. Do you want to come out with the team after work?" And I'm well, that's like, People "Yeah, yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, I, I do want to come out with the team after work, yeah. and I'm even feeling like popular." Oh wow! Like. I got invited out with, what, the team. with the team. The Boy. person that you know does the milkshake yeah. with the one that. So he was yeah. like, "Stay behind late that day," and obviously, and I was like, "Oh, because when you stay behind a bit later, you get more pay." Da, da, da. Yeah. So okay. I, don't, I don't even know if you get more pay, but I'll get more money. Yeah, because you're yeah. working more yeah. hours, right? Yeah. So it was about twelve a.m. Okay. So I was was on closing. So I was on closing that night, and I remember um, everyone left. Mm -hmm. So. Just hold, just hold him. I'll hold him. One sec, guys. Yeah, you don't want to hear about mommy being sexually harassed, <laughs> do you? Sorry, close your ears, mate. Close your ears. Hey, cheeky butt. Yeah, so I was like, yeah, um, I do, I do, uh, no, so everyone had left, sorry, and I was confused, I was like, why is everyone left, it's just me and him, so I went to him and I was like, is everyone meeting us there or something, at the place, 
Okay. And he was like, oh, um, everyone kind of dropped out. It's only two from another store. Because he was saying that all the different McDonald's stores were coming in Croydon. My days. So he was like, it's, it's only two from another store. So I was a bit like, oh, that's a bit rubbish. Yeah. I was like, oh, no, but they're fun. We'll have fun with them. Okay. So I t- my radar kind of was like, choo, choo, yeah. choo. But not every really. McDonald's store. Because I was like, you know, he didn't say that. He didn't say only two of us. He was like, the other people from Croydon will be coming. But okay. everyone from this one's not coming. Okay. So my okay. radar was cool. a bit like, choo, choo, choo. Yeah. but not really. Because I'm like, oh, if the other people are coming, it's going to be fine. Cool. So we got to Croydon now. And there was only two people. So I was like, huh? So I was a bit like to him, oh. He was like, yeah. And he was like, oh, we're going to go to like a bar in Croydon. And I was like, I'm not just at, at that time. 16 year olds didn't look like the 16 year olds now. Yeah, yeah, agreed. So I had natural hair, yeah. and I think it was in one, a little ponytail. <laughs> like, you know, the little fan. <laughs> yeah, the little, little fan. And I didn't know where to make up, yeah. so I just was plain faced. Yeah. And I was wearing Lonsdale shoes. Oh, wow. Lonsdale, like these little, like, you know, them slip on yeah, shoes. Yeah, 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 yeah. They had yeah. like a little plastic front. Exactly what you're talking <laughs> about. Like, I think they were, ninja shoes. I think like, the they, they were army. <laughs> Come on, you're taking the piss. <laughs> army ninja shoes wow so i remember i was just like hey baby <laughs> so i remember i was just like oh, okay um i'm not dressed and he was like oh she can diana let's call her diana yeah. diana can borrow you some stuff because it was a girl diana and a boy harry okay because it will cool. make me remember yeah, yeah. yeah so i was like okay diana um let's um she was like she'll do my makeup and stuff so i was like oh okay so we went to diana's house and imagine like with my ugly clothes like jeans i think jeans and like a top yeah. t-shirt she gave me like these black wedged heels or something <laughs> and like she gave me like mascara oh wow and like a blusher or something i just oh, looked wow. so silly yeah, yeah, yeah. and then he was like <laughs> um let's go so I we went to this it. bar and then i was like this is obviously i'm so innocent as well yeah. so we've gone into the bar now and and then I was nervous because I thought we were going to get him, but I got him. And then he was just giving me, buying me drinks. like, And it weren't like, you know, like I was used to back then. I think I was 16. I was 16, I said. So I would have been used to maybe drinking an alcopop. I mean, I've had an alcopop once yeah. or twice with my friends. I yeah. was still so naive at this stage, 16. I didn't know much. I said, and he was giving me wine, loads of glasses of wine, to the point where I couldn't. I was so wasted, yeah, wow. faded. Do you know how many glasses? More I feel like five. I had I had about five. My days, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was like... You're on your way. You know me. <laughs> so I was way. <laughs> yeah, 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 I was on my way. I was way, 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 way. way, way. way. So I'm my drinking days. this now. I'm drinking it. And um, like, I'm just gone. And I'm like, so I can't drink anymore. So he starts dancing with me. But from the front, I'm 16. When you dance with people, you dance with them from the back. And I'm already feeling a bit like... Oh, like uncomfortable. How close from the front? Like just just like front of you? just a bit to the front of me. Okay, cool. but I really feel a bit uncomfortable. Yeah. So. He's your manager at work. He's my manager at work. Yeah, but yeah. I just felt so like I had to because I'm like oh mm, like you. he's like he's oh I'm here yeah and I'm yeah. here I can't act like do you yeah. know what I mean and got they've you. all got me out and then you know Diana's gonna be looking at me funny and so's yeah. Harry so. Like, Diana's just like, she keeps saying to me, you're so pretty, you're so pretty. And I'm like, oh, thank you. Mm. 16, naive. Yeah. She's like 30. So I'm like, oh, thank you, thank you. So they're like, they want to go to another club in West. I'm like, oh, I don't think I can go. I don't have no money to get to West, to get back from West. I'm like, yeah. I was like, I'll get you a cab back after, don't worry. Yeah. So we go to this club now in West End. Mm-hmm. And I'm even feeling more out of my depth because I'm drunk. I'm even more drunk now. Yeah. And then he buys me more drinks. My yeah, God. and then I'm like, I can't take any more. So Mark and Diana, not Mark, Harry and Diana have kind of gone away. Okay. And I'm just. And were you able to verify that Harry and Diana were, actually worked at McDonald's? Yes, they did. They did. Yeah? They did. How do you know that? Because I went to the McDonald's. Oh, okay. And they, cool, yeah, cool, they cool, came cool, out cool, and they had cool. the uniform or whatever, right, and they got changed got at Diana's got house. So. Okay. Got we've got. We're in the club now, and obviously different people. Like Diana's with this other girl. I don't know who she is. Yeah. And um, they both come to me and like, oh, you're so pretty you're so so pretty and i'm like thank you and then my manager's dancing but i'm just it's a blur so i am talking to you this is blurry now because i don't know it's like i'm kind of just like it's like mm, you know what like something's like that yeah, i'm just like the music's playing and it's like old school like just like candy yeah, that sort of music yeah. but for the whole night. Yeah, okay, so, right, yeah. So, and then he's literally now dancing with me like this. 
from the front. Okay, got you. And like, you're so beautiful, you're so beautiful to me. And I'm like, oh, I want to go home. I want to go home. You actually like, started telling them. Yeah, that. and I want to go home now. Yeah. Sorry, it's your face. The worry in your face. No, because that's it's I'm okay. like, <laughs> I want to go home now. <laughs> and he's like, you want to go home? And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, okay, just wait a little bit. So then Diana comes to me and she's like, why do you want to go home? And she's like, I remember she had like an accent. I think she was South African. And she's like, let me try. Why do you want to? Why? No, that's Indian. Yeah, oh. you're the worst. Yeah, why I'm you wanna, usually the one worse at accents. Why do you want to go home? No. Um, what, <laughs> forget, it, forget it. Forget it. Forget it. Mandela. <laughs> why do you want to? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just give it up. Just give it up, man. <laughs> why you want to go home? <laughs> that's <what I'm> <laughs> <laughs> so she's like, she's like, anyway, she's like, I can't do accents, sorry guys. She's like, why do you want to go home? I can when I hear it. She's like, why do you want to go home? And I'm like, oh, I'm just, I'm just like tired. And she's like, um, cause me and let's call this what girl Sarah. Mm -hmm. Why don't you come with us? Well, so I'm where? like, what do you mean? Are you going home? Yeah. And she's like, no, we want to have a threesome. Wow. And I'm like, huh? So this is what I'm like, huh? Yeah, huh? yeah, 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 yeah. Like, this is when my, yeah. and, I, and I go to him and I'm like, so I go to him now, and I'm like, yeah. I need to go home, I need to go yeah. home. And he's like, okay, okay, okay. So he takes me outside and, he's, and he calls like a black cab. So okay. he, he circles over a black cab and then he gets in the cab. So I'm like, he's like, oh, I live, in, I live near Croydon. I, like, he lives near where I live, Croydon, but yeah. near where I live, because I live South Croydon. So I'm like, okay, and it's just so hot. And then he's like holding me and stuff. And I'm like, get off me. He's like, I'm going to mm. get you lingerie. Mm. Why don't you come to my house? And I'm like, oh no, goodness. no, like, no, no, I need to, so now I know what, like, yeah, I kind of realise what yeah, danger yeah, yeah. I'm in what's to a certain extent. So yeah. I'm like, no, take me home, please, please, please. And he's like, to the cab driver, his address. So I'm like, no, 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 you don't understand. And my battery's dead. I don't have no phone. My battery's dead. Oh, and I'm dead. drunk. It must have been short. So I was like, no, please, can I go home? Can I go home? So the cab driver's like, oh, where does she want to, because I think the cab driver kind of clocks it. in. That's like, good. Where does she want to go? And he's like, okay. He's like, okay, like he gets a bit upset and he's like, okay, what sh like tells me my address. And then I get home and I remember being so drunk and I remember getting into my bed and realizing what happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And feeling like, oh my God. One second! Feeling like, oh yeah. my God. And I remember we get in the, I get, I, I get up the next day and I'm just like, I could, something could have really happened to me. Absolutely. What do you mean? And then I remember going to the work the next day. Yeah. Yeah in the evening and literally he didn't even take eye contact with me my days he didn't look at me yeah. at all yeah 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 and and he what didn't... were you feeling that way the I fact felt that so shame yeah, Sh yeah, like, yeah. i just felt weird i don't know like now when i look back at it i feel like i feel so silly for feeling the way i felt yeah because i didn't do anything wrong yeah but i felt so and then everyone at my work was looking at me and i felt so weird and then basically so during this time, yeah, just before this, one week before this, what, a member of my a workplace had called me and I was like, how did you, Sam, let's call him, let's call him his name, man, because you ain't going to know him, Godfrey, yeah? <laughs> so Godfrey called me and it was like, hello, Kassan, he's, he's got African accent, yeah. so he's like, hello, my beautiful, and I'm yeah. like, Godfrey, how did you get my number? Yeah. And he's like, my darling, my baby, and I'm like, no. Yeah. How did you get my number? Yeah. He's like, oh, I got it from work, my darling. But you're so pretty, and I, I always see you at work, and I want to tell you, and I want to know if you want to go out with me for some drinks. And I'm like, no. I'm like, you're a big man. He's yeah. this Godfrey's like forty. Yeah. I'm like, you're a big man. And I was like, and I've heard you've got a wife, like. Yeah. And he's like, yeah, but baby, I want to take you out for some drinks. So I'm like, no. And I'm like, anyway, Godfrey, like, and I lock him off. Yeah. yeah? So, imagine now I've gone to work, and. As I've gone to, so this is what happens. I've gone to work. Everyone's acting weird with me. He, the, my manager's not talking to me. I go home and I get another phone call, and it's like, "Hello, this is Godfrey's wife, no. and my name is yeah Amanda," and and I'm like Amanda from work. So then I realise that Amanda works in McDonald's too, my and he's days. like, "I don't know why you are um, trying to date my husband." And I'm like, no me? Days. I'm like, no, Godfrey no. got my number. And I'm telling her, she's like, don't even try it. Because I know that you want my husband. Husband. My husband. <laughs> I know you want my husband. And I'm like, I'm, I'm confused. I'm like, you really think I want your 40 year old husband? So anyway, I go into work again the next day. I'm a manager, my other manager, Which one? the, the one store that's... manager. Okay. That one that was the man, is like my line manager. Okay. Yeah, this is the store manager now. Yeah. Calls me into the office and is like, basically, 
Cassandra, um, you know, you've got to be really careful with how you're conducting yourself because you're causing problems for yourself. My days. My days, why? Because you accepted the invitation. Because I went out, My and days. I don't even know. She, she's talking about. She's talking to me about Godfrey, and it's like at the end of the day, someone's husband, Amanda and Godfrey work here. You can't. And I'm like, I'm I'm looking at my manager like, are you okay? He's my he's my dad. Yeah. Godfrey is my dad, and why would actually like Amanda has told us everything that's happened, and that's what I'm saying. So basically, it's like the talk of work. Mm. So I just feel shamed. I feel like. I don't know. And at the time, there was a boy that I kind of liked. You know now, because you didn't know before. But I, yeah, a boy that I kind of liked. And obviously, we used to make jokes and stuff at work. Yeah. But now he doesn't make jokes with me because he's probably thinking that I'm trying to move yeah, to the absolutely. manager. Yeah, and yeah. I'm some loose girl who yeah. just tries to sleep with people's husbands. Man, and they, they got a tactic that that don't feel like their first time. Like he knows who he's going out with. For her to come and be as forward as let's have a threesome, they must have marks. They must know what they're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, that's happened, guys, and I'm I can't believe it. And I end up maybe working in like another two weeks, and then I leave because it's just awkward, yeah. and I don't get paid enough, and I just didn't like the feeling that I was feeling, and I didn't go to anyone because I was just so shamed, and it's yeah. just so sad, and I, it, it kind of makes me know that anyone that's going through something like that at work, you don't if a manager's even just doing too much, saying too much to you, or you know being too friendly, that is you don't no you don't have to stand for that. That mm. it made me realize in any other job, I never anytime anyone did that sort of stuff, I yeah. would always make it very clear it's not that like. Got you bro loads of bro in yeah. loads of you could be my dad yeah. like i would make it clear <laughs> no i didn't care anymore because yeah, yeah, i had I enough you. yeah I and imagine about two years ago i saw the manager in brixton i remember something and like that. he is a police officer i remember you saying i remember you okay now and i was even shaken up a bit yes, when i saw him yes, i was like yes he's yes. a police officer my days like, and even to this day, like obviously I don't rem- like I didn't look. The, the if you're thing using that was hard, your McDonald's power, I didn't know his name. I don't know his name, and I just saw him in passing. Hey. And I obviously like I don't know what police place he's working at, but yeah, it's just goes to show me like goes to show that don't just because someone's got a uniform on or whatever, don't mm. just think yeah. you can go somewhere with them. Like yeah. or even if they work in your workplace, Absolutely. because they could and something like that could end up happening to you. So yeah. just be very careful, well, be vigilant, ladies. Be, yeah, vigilant. be vigilant, like vigilant when you're you know even when you're at work because literally, I don't want what happened to me to happen to you. Okay. And I always thank God that it didn't. He didn't try anything yeah, yeah. because he could have done something to me. Yeah. And in my drunkenness, in the state I was in, and that would have staying power. I would, stay with of you. course it yeah, would it yeah, stayed with absolutely. me that you yeah, understand yeah. so if he had done something extra and on top of that i would like i didn't speak out i was too timid so i wouldn't have spoken out at the time mm. i doubt it and that would have affected me forever so just be careful with the males in your workplace that are doing or saying certain things to you and that you see as innocent or you're thinking oh you know if you say something you might get in trouble no it's not about trouble literally like yeah no stay speak safe. up stay safe stay safe but that is my story Hope you enjoyed it, and hope you've learned something from I it. I didn't actually enjoy it. But yeah. I guess we learned not something. Jo- from not not enjoyed it, it yeah. but you know, I hope yeah. you've learned something no, from agreed. it. It's but we gotta go out, guys, because yeah. we're going to our next um, viewing. viewing. But wait, wait. Let's say let's say hey to Lai. Lai Lai. <laughs> oh, Lai Lai. <laughs> I don't know if I'm holding you right. I'm holding you right. You okay? Say hey, Lai Lai. <laughs> say hey, Lai Lai. Say hey, Lai Lai. Say hey! All right, guys. Hey, take him. I don't. I don't want to. Yeah. What is it? Okay. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Stay hashtag locked, locked in. in. Bye, like, guys. Comment, subscribe, all of that. Good yeah. stuff. Yeah.